Look at this, we got, you could sleep anywhere and you put your head in the dirt. Good, wonderful, beautiful morning from the campground, buddy ends. Oh my goodness, so last night, it got, I'll take you guys outside in a minute, I'll show you the lake, I already walked the dogs this morning, but uh, last night it was so windy, it was crazy. You may notice that the slide out back there is already in. Let me tell you what's going on. So this trip in general was not like a, oh, we're gonna go camping and we're gonna go for this song. We had one night reserved. We're about three and a half hours away from home. We had one night reserved. The plan was if we wanted to stay here tonight, we were gonna just get another spot, which there's, unfortunately the spot we're in is taken so we'd have to move anyway, long story short, we could move down to the other side. I think we're gonna go move down to St. Ignis, to the Straits area park. My parents have never been there. This is kind of more of just a chill and relax type of trip. My parents have been watching the kids a lot for my brothers, so we're just kind of trying to do a little chill and relax type of trip. Ooh. Yeah, what do you think of that? That's a non-stop breeze. It's a non-stop. Oh. Hi, Lure. Non-stop breeze, but it feels kind of good. For a second? Yeah. <laughs> it's like 45 degrees outside, so that's the other thing I was going to tell you guys. It went from 72 yesterday to about 42, 43 with wind. So I think we're gonna pack up and move to another campground where it actually is supposed to be 60, so quite a bit warmer. Jamie's hooking up the Jeep. I thought I'd come show you the lake this morning real quick. The waves are, the waves are deceiving. They're a lot bigger than you think. You can kind of see them crashing. Let's see if I can zoom in. So you can see them crashing down there. It's deceiving. Those are coming way up on the shore compared to where they were last night. The sun did peak out, but it's 42 degrees. But like I said, not too bad. The wind is kind of up and down. Jamie's hooking her up. She does look good behind the motorhome. There's your, there's your full view, guys. He's uh, getting her hooked up. Dogs are inside. We're gonna move to the next campground. And it is supposed to be nice and sunny at the next one, like I said, and a lot warmer. Can you guys see the swarm? <laughs> so there's construction on US 2. Look, there's a really, really pretty view of the lake, but the swarm and it's windy and we've still got them see i think some of them are mayflies little baby mayflies. they could be it could be like i see one right here that has a long tail oh yeah this one does too uh, mayfly, it's bug season in the up hopefully this next campground they're not too bad if they are we're going somewhere else <laughs> <laughs> but the lake's pretty so even though we have to wait for construction we get this nice pretty view of lake michigan and the dogs are like sound asleep back there mm -hmm. they're like this is great well kira's awake i guess hi kira so like don't talk to me i'm relaxing <laughs> indy's like hard. will you pet me hey guess what mm -hmm. we made it to the next campsite we made it to another campsite and this and, one's pretty cool and it is and it's not as buggy as the road was yeah i mean <laughs> A little it's bit. Hit and miss. A little bit. So we originally set up over there because it was an open site and then somebody reserved it so we had to move. So mom and dad are right there. We were on the other side of them. So we moved over here. We got the shady spot, hun. Yeah. We're kinda yeah. kinda like in the woods. Mm -hmm. Oh, I found the bugs as soon as I walked out into the sun. And anyway, what we were saying is this is a really cool campsite. Because look, there's the Mackinac Bridge. Oh, there's some bugs. Okay, I'm coming back into the shade. There's less bugs in the shade. Maybe that's why. Airplane, I hear him. He's probably going to the island. So anyway, we're set up at our next campsite. And again, just kind of chilling, relaxing. I might go to the bridge view later on. We'll see. Look at this. We got, you could sleep anywhere and you put your head in the dirt. Of course, Kira is in her chair as always, catching bugs. Oh, she caught that one. You caught him. She's like, I got that bug, guys. Did you see it? I'm on one channel. And then Eleanor is like, what are we doing? Are we ready to go? What's going on? Are we doing something? What we're going to do is I'm going to run into town with my mom into St. Ignace here. And we're going to go check out some of the shops. I'm going to bring a camera with me. And you girls are going to go take a nap with your dad. And Grandpa's going to take a nap with Indy. And I still can't get over. This is the view from our campground. So, oh, look, a seagull. So cool. This is a pretty good one. I like this spot. So mom and I came to downtown St. Ingus. I'm going in the fudge shop. You guys know it. That's my favorite kind of fudge. But uh, we're in this little gift shop. And uh, look, it's a penny machine. You can turn your penny into a souvenir of the bridge. Always the gift shops that have all the random gifts of random. And of course, the Bigfoot shirts. So, because you know, he lives here. If you guys didn't know that, it's for real. Look, there he is. He's right there. I found him. 
you know we're coming to get the fudge. I wish you guys could have smell-o-vision. Yeah, you can just get one, but nobody does that. So you guys know I wasn't leaving that store without some fudge. I got three different kinds. It was cheaper if you bought three. So of course I bought three. And yes, I'm back at the camper. The girls are like, what did you bring us? I didn't bring anything, but I'll make you, I'll make you lunch in a minute. And I gotta show you guys what else I found. So you guys know we love Catan. I got the dragon scenario, treasure, dragons, and adventures. Now, unfortunately, they still haven't made this for a four to six player expansion, and we usually play with five people, but I think, I think, it, I think we can make it work. We'll have to run through it a few times, but I think we'll be able to make it work. I play this version online all the time. You guys know how much we love Catan. I'm excited for this. It was at a little hobby shop right on the shelf, and I couldn't believe it, so I had to buy Ma'am, are you barking at the oven? Yeah. Uh, my food's in there. You're right. Your food is in the oven. I will get it for you in just a minute. It's got to soak, and then you can have it. Mm. Yeah, you know they're done when they're when they're brown and popping open. <laughs> <laughs> That's when they're good. Yeah. Like Terry said, they got to be black. That's right. <laughs> what do you think, Miss Indy? She's like, I would eat a hot dog. We're out here. We're making some dinner. We've been hoping to see some boats go under the bridge over here, but we haven't seen really any ships or anything under the bridge. I mean, there's the ferries going back and forth to the island, of course. Let's see, I see a ferry out there, but that's it. And he's like, well, now he's behind the tree. This is gonna look really pretty tonight. I'm gonna have to come out here and get some photos. I think our setup's pretty good. We're kind of hidden in the trees and mom and dad are over here. I got my starling cooked up and that's all working, but there's bugs, but they're not that, like you guys can see them. They're really not that annoying. They're not biting bugs. And thankfully they're not like in my face. So that helps. Indy, are you a tabletop dog? <laughs> Indy's like, um, yeah, I'm a tabletop dog. Uh, Jamie went to go take a shower. We're hanging out here. It's starting to get a little chilly. They said we're gonna have a frost warning tonight. The dogs just saw a dog go by. So they're very alert right now. They were very excited to see another dog, but they're saying it's supposed to frost tonight. So we'll be fine. We all got heaters, but. Hopefully we'll be able to get some nice night shots tonight. That's what I'm hoping for. I might do a time lapse of the bridge. Okay, girls. You girls are gonna hang out in here with dad while he watches some television with you girls. Cause you know, that's always super fun. I'm gonna go win all the money at the casino. Say, yeah, I'm gonna win it all. What do you think? I could buy you all the things. All right, take care of the girls. I'll be back. And maybe we'll win big. Push the button. Now I gotta watch this button. That's better than nothing. Mom and I are playing the machines that make a lot of money. Or a lot of money. <laughs> well, maybe they'll make a lot of money. They make a lot of noise. I won $11.96 off of all that noise. But it looks cool. Anyway, that's what we're doing. We're in here and we're playing some playing some games. Oh, Mom's getting all kinds of stuff. Oh, you got the wild spark. I'm just going to give you a bunch of wilds. In the wrong spot. So I only filmed a little tiny bit in the casino, but, and most of the time I do pretty good. But yeah, you're right, I can't always rob a bank. So now it's dark. If what I'm trying right now does not work, actually I'll take you guys out there and show you as well, but I'm trying to get a GoPro time-lapse, night-lapse of the bridge. If you don't see it, it means somebody stole my GoPro. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll take you guys out there real quick so you can see the bridge on this camera and then we'll insert, hopefully, the night lapse, and if not, we'll insert some photos. I won a little bit of money. I walked out with about $75, so that's not too bad. I think I did pretty good. So you can't always rob the bank. I can't always rob the bank. <laughs> I can't. I try. I try really hard. Yeah. This camera might have a hard time focusing, but basically you can see the Mackinac Bridge all lit up over there. This is a pretty cool campsite. I gotta admit. What a view. fun camping see this was a pretty chill trip huh not a lot of our normal hikey hikey stuff that wasn't the plan for this trip it was planned to be a relaxing trip and I think we all needed that look at she's like guys I'm so relaxed it's amazing what do you think ma'am I got her nice step here to help her get up here you did pretty good huh she's like guys I'm a champion I don't know what mom is complaining about I can do everything 
And then let's see, where do we find Miss Eleanor? Are you already in bed? She's like, guys, did you check out my cool blue light back here? Yeah, are you ready for bed? All right, you guys, we're gonna go ahead and end today's video. We hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big. And we will see you again soon. Can I get boops? I can't reach all the way over there. You're so far away. Okay, thanks. Good night, audience.